Sometimes it's very, very impressive. Up top, the secret of hunting. Well, they know someone's there. They find he my door. Him. They catch him. Mid Icarus dive. And that, without a doubt, will be your first blood and going to mid one as well. Got the ward down. He's gonna get it. To get it. And that is the courier gone. Let's get it. the Wraith Fan delivered. And there's nothing on it. Mid one. Indeed, three heroes moving on to mid one. Uh oh, mid one. He's dead. I'll get the courier. I'll get the kill as well. Laser and rocket from Miracle to finish off mid one. My control should be pretty happy with the, the way that the lane setups are happening. Phoenix versus Tidehunter, he should be able to get a good chunk of farm here versus the Anchor Smash since he's ranged. He doesn't affect it. Uh, taking a lot here. Caustic this chilling touch. He is surely going to pop one more touch, would do it, and Yapsaw can find it. You can put them all around along the tree lines later on in the game. You can have that scout, but this happening is a big disaster. Arc Warden is one of those heroes that if you actually die too many times early on, versus him. Secret do finally move the lanes once again, taking Ace down here, yep. away from the live stealer. And Yapsaw uh, hunting down Mind Control. He's going out of the trees. Three has the first dive mid, mid lane again. This liquid. And him and my man, ready to come in, but Savage Roll forces him back. GH just get the slow with the void, and they should be able to claim this spare hit. Can he deny it? That gold. Oh, oh he, he gets can! Oh my You're not getting that 300 gold, he says. They want him now. They're like, you it, deny it? It'll summon a new one. And he's okay. with that, he's fine. Yapsa and Puppy turn up. They're ready to turn this around. Looking towards Kuroki. He's been left behind. Secret jump in. Even though Liquid did lose that last game. Mid lane, they're looking for Miracle. Play. Mid lane. The stun. Miracle. Trying for the TP out. Knows he can't make it. Secret find the kill. The wraparound into the mid lane. When Miracle respawns, they will probably try to go for mid one here. Puppy, though, walking into them. He tanks the gank. Yapsaw's there to try and help out. The Burrow Strike and mid one looking to turn. Has the flux onto GH. GH backing up, standing close to Kuro. Race down, blocking off the path. Liquid have to be careful with their retreat. They're not going to get GH out of there. GH goes down. Mind Control's come through. He's bringing mid one down very, very low. He's trying his best to finish off this Arc Warden. Gets another Spirit out onto him. And Mind Control will be able to claim the mid one kill. Kuroki's able to deny himself to the Ancient, so Yapsaw can't find that. Mind Control picks up a second. He's got a double. Whatever. Wave. We'll get over the tree line. And Butter. Probably be able to find him for now. Does have phase boost, so this lane can be even scarier for any members of the liquid to come in mid lane, mid one, dove upon. They'll get the kill, cost them GH's life. Yep, so see if you can chase down Miracle Control for the bear to get. And taking his lane away from him, they'll find the tower. He's swoop forward looking for Yapsaw. Does still have a burrow strike to break away. And uh, there are other members of the team around. Fada's gonna head in with the wraparound, and this Phoenix has been baited in. And to base, TP's up. Towards top, Sal's up. He's ready to continue this to farm. Fix me right At least alone. 20 seconds and the bear will be back. And then this one not too fun against this tied down bottom mid lane. Miracle. Mid one. Oh, so toward mid. He is spotted by Ward though. So Miracle. Unlikely to get caught by this top now. Savage Raw. Pushing back GH. Flight control. Still with a man inside him. They'll jump out. Look towards Ace. Ace is gone. The supernova. <laughs> Kuroki actually denied the catapult bottom for Vada and Vada gives him an edge. <laughs> yeah, so top getting got it. Has no stun, has no stun storm either. Maxima Max. Mid one with the Midas out. Top lane, GH. Actually going GH. In a lot of trouble here. Radiance would you get the ice blast, but they're chasing that man. And they'll continue to do so. No let up for GH. He's rooted, taken out. Arc Warden and Phoenix will have it. Finale one. I'm gonna find Fada here. He does have the hood, and he has got the shrine by him as well. We'll see if they have the damage to bring him down. It's a bit of a hard hero to go in upon. Ravage comes in into the ice bars, the burrow as well. Oh, I, that was questionable at the at the best. Going on the titan to like that under a shrine as that well. That is the bigger issue this game. The Arc Warden or the Tinker. Both absolute nightmares if they get their items. Mid lane, mid, mid one, one. gets jumped on. They've got the combo, but to a man brought in by mind control. Ice blast flies through. The absorb will go down as well. Liquid, keep everyone alive. Awesome. They're gonna jump in, look to close the gap. Mid one trying to hold them back, but with two heroes chasing him, he's gonna need some backup, and backup is inbound. TP's coming in, he'll drop down the field. Supernova's there on the sidelines, though. Mid one, he will fall. Ice blast comes in over to Matsuma Man, but still with the rage, ready to fight. He's trying for it, but the Ravage comes in. Fada holds him back. And mid one actually claiming the double kill there is the following out from them with these two heroes combined on the same team. Radiant are scanning. Scan comes out. It actually does catch Liquid here. 
They are positioned here for an infest bomb. They're going in anyway, though. They are straight in. Looking for Mipwon. Mipwon gets the field down. They've got the bro truck in the air coming through with the ult. Matuma Man rages. He's able to finish out Mipwon and the Tempest double. Supernova's falling low. Puppy nearly able to claim it, but he can't quite. Mind Control gets the ult off. Raise out onto the Puppy. Pipe comes through from Fada. Is it enough to say Puppy it is? And Mind Control swoops forward. Takes down a second. And now Fada's in trouble. He's surrounded. Brown the tree line. Three members down on Secret. Yapso tried to jump in, but the silence was still on him, so he couldn't react. Has to back away. Get very, very strong. Miracle top. He's getting chased out here by the Radiance, but he's in a very deep spot. Uh, he can't blink. He didn't expect that Radiance. It's only just come out. The rest of Liquid, though, coming in for the defense. I don't know. Miracle get through this one. Mike's drama to a man. Turn him. Oh, he gets the blink off. Miracle, he's going to live. He managed to blink out just in time, gets himself out of the range of the Spark Wraith, and Secret, they've lost two. They do get the Ice Blast down onto Matuma Man, and they get Mind Control. So this time, Secret able to bite back pretty hard. They'll surround Kuro. Kuro, could he get himself out of this? GH trying to get a look in onto Ace, but Kuro in a lot of trouble. Ace brings the bear back through. Kuro trying to fly himself away. Ravage actually comes out from Fada as he looks to lock down the Nine Stroke as well, and he does find him. Miracle jumped in desperately, looking to finish off Ace. In fact, they do get him. GH able to get the final void to kill off the lone druid. He'll almost certainly pay with his life if Yapsa and Puppy can find him. He's looking for the Dukes in the trees, still alive for now. But they do spot him out. He silences the Sand King, but with three heroes there, GH will fall as well. On my control, they're claiming the high ground here. Who's going to get the jump on who? Yapsaw heading over. Right, just moving out of they, range. They see mid. They see Ace in the mid lane. They're going in. They are. They're trying to move in straight away onto mid one. Supernova comes out. Secret having to split, having to back up. Mid one forces himself away. G8 finds the rage for the void. They'll close the gap onto the arc. Quarter Ravage comes in from Fada though. He's keeping mid one alive. Mid one still trying to back off. And mid one, can he live? No, he can't. GH will be able to chase and finish it off. But they lose Matuma Man. Liquid moving in for more though. They've got the numbers. They've taken down three. Only Fada and Yapsaw left alive on Secret. Eyes onto Yapsaw looking to juke it off with the Sandstorm and Burrow Strike will make it up to the high ground, but GH, Miracle Mind Control, they're, they're diving into the base. GH, he's got to back off. A little early to dive behind the tier 3s, and he will slide himself out of the base. We'll get himself out of the range of the Ice Blast. Yeah, I've got rules to set up for more, but no, they're already backing away. Let's see it. Yep, so he doesn't want any part of this. He's already out of it. And Fudder will start to retreat as well. Miracle, oh, Ravage. as he gets caught though, Fudder, he knows he's there because the March positioning coming through, jumps in, finds Miracle, and Miracle's down. Secret, get in mid lane. To the other side, Japsa finds the jump bar strike onto GH. Rolling in with the Yours, there's the silence, the damage from mid one and the bear, more than enough. They'll take a kill, Mind Control has the Tumor Man inside, they'll swoop forward, they have the Supernova, trying to go for this. Can they get the kills out of it? They'll look towards the bear, bear being brought low, not enough to take him down. They'll pop the Aegis once on mid one, mid one force back. He'll be able to get himself away, Fada moving in, doesn't have Ravage though. Won't be able to pop it. Hard to do, and especially because he's spending a lot of time inside Mind Control. Yep. They need to find the action liquid. Fada's on the high ground here. GH with that Aghanims, he does see all of Secret here. Oh, here we go, ready to jump. They come through immediately, but the Ravage from Fada comes out in response. They get the Silence as well onto the Phoenix. Ice Blast is coming in. They force the Phoenix out of the sideline. Mind Control, Tickler, he gets the chance to pop the Supernova. Wow. Secret have to back away. Miracle trying to go for the chase onto the Tide. If Fada was ever so low, but he does manage to get himself out to safety. But they get Ace. Ace is not going to be as fortunate indeed. Ah, uh, refresh. Sorry, yeah. Matu, almost AC finished. Very, very close to that. Fada actually jumping in onto Miracle. Yapsaw's there with the world of the Burrow Strike, and that's going to be Miracle Bursted. Just gets deleted as he sits outside the base, allowing Secret to get the quick jump on him. And now, Secret seeing if they can chase down for more. They'll turn towards Matumba Man again. Yapsaw with a two man Burrow Strike. BKB comes through from Matumba. Turns, tries to fight up against the bear, bringing it down low. The Sun Ray percentage base damage also helping, but it's not quite enough. They'll get the bear back. Matumba Man and the rest trying to retreat, but again, Yapso, uh, second push, oh, there's the save! They'll pick up Matumba Man, protecting him, Winter's Curse also holds back the rest of Secret. And now they'll dive in, Mind Control sweeps back through across Secret. Nice little play there, picking up Matumba Man, uh, Yapso, he's still looking for more, jumps in with the strike onto this Winter's Wife, and they'll force him back. Again, the Savage Roar from Ace, shoving this Phoenix out of the fight, Cold Embrace is there for Kuroki, but Mind Control surrounded, the Cold Embrace will not be enough to save the Firebird. See what they can do. Fighter on the front does have Ravage available again. 
We've got the darkness. GH, so only with the silence. Spine control switch for they find Puppy. Puppy's down. No AA for this fight. They're trying to move in for more liquid. Mid one's there with the response. They've got the control. The Bloodthorn as well. Down onto GH is enough damage with the Spark Grave. GH is down. But Swimmer Man moving in with the BKB going straight for the Arc Warden. Cuts through mid one. He's looking for the Tempest double as well. And he'll get it. Both of Arc Wardens down. And they're Ace not even done. They're finding Ace as well. Buyback comes out from mid one. But Matuma Man's already got the triple kill. Mid one has got to be seriously careful about spend it. They've got to be very careful. And mid one had to use it. Yeah, they, they can't let mid one drop. Up top, caps up off. Bada, they find the catch onto Miracle. Can they bring him down with the Ravage? They certainly can. Miracle gone. He's out for 100. They can't finish the Roche. They can't. They've got to back away without that Tinker to protect the area. Perfect trap coming up from Secret. The team fight's still very scary from, from Liquid. And look at mind control. Yep. They may be ready to go for some sort of <laughs> sneaky play. Secret know this though, they're smoking up, they're trying to move in from the sidelines. Mind Control will reveal himself with the Sunray, move down to the low ground, they'll find Kuro first. Moving in straight away to Wyvern, Ice Bars comes in, Mind Control and Matuma jump through, and instantly they take down the AA. Matuma Man and GH surrounding Yapsor, Yapsor gets the blink off in time off the back of the Yules, he's getting out of there. Miracle looking to chase, the mini stun of the rocket, slowing him down a little bit, jump forward again with Miracle, but the Sandstorm from Yapsor dukes out the rocket. He continues to go down with a Burrow Strike, Miracle finds the burst, he gets the range, takes him out, they'll find the Tempest double as well for sure did recover it when they killed the absolute in the top lane. I'm gonna try for the bear here, at least GH leading in. The rest of the team coming through. Mid one will TP onto the bear here. He's gonna try and send in his Tempest double to do some damage. Bring him down low with Yapsor jumping in with a Burrow Strike. Ice Bars to pass over, GH will pop. Secret get one, and they're looking for more. Fadi jumps forward, he has the Ravage to catch our Miracle. As you say, he's got the Aegis. The question is if they can bring him down twice. Supernova coming through. They're trying to put a stop to Secret, but Secret, they'll be down on the sun. Can they take it out of time? They can't. They'll pop the refresher, but the Supernova Stone catches them all. Ravage comes in from Fada. They've caught Miracle again. Miracle in a lot of trouble. Winter's curse for Kuroki. He's trying to buy space for Miracle to get out. It's enough. Miracle's able to blink himself away. Midborn gets in. He finds the Bloodthorn. Jump on. Yapsor gets the two man burrow strike. Miracle's down. Kuro's on the step as well with the blood font. The BKB out as Matuma Man is trying his best to redeem this fight. But Liquid, they've lost three. And Matuma Man surrounded as well. Yamto again. Another burrow strike holding down the life stealer. They'll beat into him. And Matuma Man slowly but surely should fall. He's getting the cheese back into his inventory. He does have the cheese. He's trying to turn towards Yapsor, but Yapsor slides himself away. My control comes back in. Matuma Man is actually going to survive it all. Pretty ridiculous how beefy that man is. Mid lane coming in to put a stop to this. Oh, they get the side, they get the bonus strike onto the Phoenix. Oh, the Ravage as well. Phoenix is down, he has to buy back straight away. Bada moving into the base. Matuma Man turns his attention towards him. Winter's curse holds back. Mid one, he's getting beat into by his own teammates. Will he go down the Splinter's Blast? Is it enough? He forces away the pipe. It will save him. Mid one will live. Matuma Man with the BKB moving forward, trying to chase down this Tide. But Tide, Bada gets the blink off in time. The bear's going to be the new target to focus on. On the back lines of it all, Yapsor gets the, he gets the ultimate. It's enough to bring down the Tinker. Tinker down for 100. But Yapsor finds the Burrow Strike, straight onto GH. Jafada trying to chase with the Shiva's Guard slow. 15 seconds and Miracle will be back. Liquid doing their best to hold until their Tinker can return. There's the first Ravage, Ravage jump forward. He's got the second one ready if needed. They find the jump immediately onto Matuma. Oh, the save! Mind Control comes in with the Aghanim Supernova. Picks up the Life Stealer. And with that Secret out to back, Miracle's coming into the fight. He's looking to get involved. Secret with a mass TPs as they just take it. Probably fine. Yeah, man, Ravage. So get it over on that man. Hope he passes it off to him. Triple Ravage at the ready. She finding uh, the GH nice knock out. Oh, my control comes in with a save. Picks up GH immediately. Matuma Man with the rage trying to move forward. Miracle jumps in. Burst down mid one once. That's the age is gone. Refresher pop by Mind Control. He's ready for another supernova. Coming in, cutting them off. Up for the high ground. The Ravage from Fada comes through. That's the first one. He's low on mana. Has to back away. Winter's curse from Kuroki. Locking down mid one. His own team take him out. Secret have lost two. And Liquid are ready to chase for more. The bots coming in on top of GH. They've got their eyes on Fada. He does still have the pipe. Miracle looking for the Yapsor Sanking instead. Yapsor slides down to the low ground, able to get the blink off. But two. Oh, he's used it right away. At the same time, though, there's still two they Ravages right left. Oh, they go in immediately. Supernova slowing down Fada here. Matuma Man with the wounds, but Fada can still walk it off. As I said, there's that double Ravage we've got to watch out for. It's going to be there. Fada comes in. There's the first. Catches four. And they're going to be able to get these kills. They look towards Mind Control. He tries to swoop down. God embraces there. Mind Control will be saved. He's able to keep himself alive thanks to the back of Akuro. They'll force back the bear. They're really trying to force this buy back. Fada does still have Refresher Shard. There's one more Ravage. 
doing everything he can with these to protect that buyback. Vada jumps in, but they do commit it this time. Buyback's through. He absorbed bit late with the Burrow Strike, with the Rage, but Man's able to back off. Is still available. There's ready up five. top. Okay. Yep, we're sending it top. And in we go. They do have backdoor. It's not enough to save this tower, though. The Bear just claims it. Now the backdoor protection's off. And the Bear, it's again going to potentially get the range racked. Fortification does come in. That's a cool. Actually, the Tempest double times out, so it doesn't get the cool. Got the base. The cool will find a pick. That GH attack speed is that talent coming into play right there. On your life. The AA down. The bear gets it's the bear. bottom. Oh, out the bear. In it goes. And here we have it. In onto the racks. He's gonna, he's he's gonna, gonna get, get it. it. It's, oh, Liquid, what do they do about this? I mean, they'll be made. They should be able to make the bear pay at least, but. The Ice Blast does connect, being the careful how to commit. Oh, the push is deep, can Miracle deal with both of these? That's the question, he's got the Hex on to both, he's trying his best to deal with this split. They may find the Bear, BKB's pop, the Bear's still alive, he's going back up the racks, but he will get taken down. Oh, that's Supernova just in time, as Mind Control nearly falls to the control of the Tempest double. Back in towards to the pit, Fada's got his eyes on GH, Kuroki and Matuma Man still outside the side of it. Fada moves him with the Hex, drops it down onto GH, Secret going into the pit, Matuma Man pops the Rage, Moving on to Fada, Fada pops the BKB. GH and Matuma trying to take down Fada. Do they have the damage? Liquid, they need backup and they need it now, but look at the base. They've got the split push again. The bear has been TP'd in. Liquid, they're having to deal with this Roche fight and the base. Oh my goodness. The base, looking to be in a lot of trouble as well. They do manage to force it back out, back towards the pit. GH has been caught out, blown up by the Ice Blast. No Night Stalker for 100 seconds. Secret, they'll claim Roshan. Liquid just getting pulled apart as there is so much for them to deal with. And now the Wyvern's in trouble. Mind Control comes in with a supernova save, dodging the Ravage for both of them. Instant refresher shard used by the Lone Druid so we can actually have a bear since that second one did die in the mid lane. They're trying to retreat. Secret looking to chase. They've found Kuro. They should be able to find him. Hex, Nullifier, the uh, Silence from the Bloodthorn as well. They've taken down two. Liquid, no buyback on GH or Kuroki. Oh my god. And as you say, still with those extra ravages, Vada pops. He pops refresher. one refresher shard. He has another one. Can Liquid really hold three against five? Wait, no, sorry. He popped his refresher shard. Oh. Ice Blast comes in. He's gonna pass over Matuma Man. Rage is popped. They look towards Yapso. Vada pops the ravage, but Matuma Man's still with the rage, trying to fight. He's looking towards the Tempest Devil, but Miracle's Miracle. been jumped on. He's down for 100. Five back from him. Five back from Mind Control. They're trying their best to hold. Matuma Man popped the BKB, but the racks are already down. Secret got what they came for. Can Liquid punish them? They'll try and push back Matuma with a Savage Roar. Matuma Man cannot chase Secret out of this. Yapso comes back in, looking for the Burrow Strike. Right. There's the second Ravage. He's called Miracle. This is going to be a dieback on Tinker. He's down for two minutes. Secret slowly but surely just breaking down Liquid in this game. And GG will be called Secret take game two as they lead this.